the Biodiversity Enrichment Experiment, Efforts B, is located at around 50 kilometers from Jambi City. It is established in a conventional oil palm plantation of around 140 hectares. Let us visit one of the experimental plots as it looked in 2019. This plot has a size of 40 times 40 square meters and is surrounded by the conventional oil palm plantation. Six years after planting, the trees reached considerable sizes. Depending on the species, the tree's height varied from 2.5 meters to 5.5 meters on average, but with large variability. Some trees reached more than 16 meters height. In this plot, six different tree species were planted. From the shape of the crowns, we can recognize four different tree species. Archidendron possiflorum and Parkia speciosa belong to the Fabaceae family and are appreciated for their fruits. Paranema canescens is used for its wood and Sharia leprosula is a timber tree belonging to the Dipterocarp family, typically present in lowland rainforests of the region. You see now the entrance of the experimental plot with some basic information in English and Bahasa Indonesia. Let's have a look at the inside of the experimental plot. You see the different tree species and also the growing understory vegetation. For example, here is a small tree of Paranema canescens. Also very common is the shrub Clydemia herta, which in fact originates from America and is invasive in our study landscape as in many other regions. Look above you. The trees and the oil palms form together a closed canopy. This creates shading and thereby regulates microclimate which is needed for many organisms. Observe the soil. You will see that it is covered by a thick layer of leaf litter. This provides a habitat for soil organisms and contains organic matter and nutrients that contribute to soil fertility. The litter comes mainly from the leaves falling from the planted trees as we could quantify using such litter traps. We measure many different aspects of biodiversity and ecological processes in our experiment plot. You can have an overview of the research activities in a different video. But before that, let's first visit another experiment plot. This plot differs from the previous one in the sense that it is dominated by one tree species, Paranema canescens, also called Sunkai. It could establish and grow very well in the oil palm canopy gaps. Because remember, we felled 40% of the oil palms, which created optimal conditions for this kind of pioneer fast-growing tree species adapted to open and disturbed habitat. More than 95% of all planted trees survived. Due to this exceptional establishment success, the trees are denser compared to the previous plot, which creates different environmental conditions. If you want, you can visit the inside of this experimental plot using the interactive icon. 